complain. There's joy here. There's worship. Don't try. Don't complain. Bless you, my friend. Bless you, my friend. Ow. It goes, my friend. You'll never complain about that. You'll never cry. Check your head. How are you feeling? Huh? I, I had a toothache. No? That's why. No? No, it's nothing. No? No. I had a toothache. Huh? I, I had a toothache. I, I was even asking my son. I wanted her to... I told my son that you should take me to the doctor to take the tooth out. So, you're saying your son must take you to the doctor to take the tooth out with your medical aid? With my medical aid. You said with your medical aid? No, with... Or with his medical his aid? His medical aid. Or with his medical aid? Yeah, I was asking him to... So, no, it's about you, my friend. You are saved. From... That's why now, your medical aid, with your medical aid, with whose medical aid? Papa. With whose medical aid? <laughs> Somebody is saved from robbery. Yeah. I love you. Somebody said, because she was going to use her son's medical to do what? Which will be causing complications after that, my friend. Because you were stealing. Yeah. I'm sorry. <laughs> Ah! I repent. Ah! Huh? I repent. Pope. That's how God will move you. You see? With whose medical aid? It will be my medical aid in future. <laughs> <laughs> so now, where's the pain? No, I don't have it. It was here. Even last week, I was like sitting like this. <laughs> hey, my friend. Now, now that when when I drank, it it went straight here. Oh, to where the pain was. Uh -huh. And now, I don't know what happened. Then there's the pain disappeared. It's gone. Yeah. Wow. Tell tell your son his medical aid is for his family, not for you. <laughs> <laughs> Who else was going to do robbery here? It's your day for repentance and see the Lord's face. <laughs> Go give your testimony. It's done for you. Blessed viewers who are in Rawani Center Ministries, this is the year of the joy set before us by our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. With me here is our mother who was ministered unto by the man of God, Professor Lesuho Daniel, concerning the toothache that she's been suffering with for a long time. We are to hear from her as to what was going on into her life and how was she affected and how long has she been suffering. Mama, could you please introduce yourself to the viewers? Please tell us your name and where you're coming from. Okay, my name is Margaret Ngobeni. I'm from Soshanguve. Concerning the toothache, could you please tell us what was going on with it? I had this toothache, I think, for almost three months. Um, I, I would put a, 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 a tablet right inside the hole, you know, and some of the tablets, they will cause, um, what you call it, a uh, allergy. I'll wake up the following day with a swollen uh, lip, and that's how I was uh, surviving until I think it's two weeks ago, then I asked my son if he can go to a, a, a dentist and speak to the dentist and ask him if it's possible for the doctor to take the, my, my tooth with his name, but the tooth is mine, but using his name because I don't have medical aid anymore. So, Mama, could you please tell us this tooth, when you say that it has a hole, like how were you coping during cold conditions? So that's why I said I, I would put the whole pill inside the hole. That's how I was uh, surviving. I would drink one, but put one here. 
uh, every time. That, so I thought my best solution was my son to go and sp uh, speak to the doctor so that I can use his medical aid to take out the tooth. But, you know, uh, 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 something happened. I think I asked him two weeks ago, but it didn't go according to my plan because I think God had uh, knew that I would wait to get a, a, a healing. It keep on my son because I don't stay with him. He will keep on saying, no, I haven't spoken to the doctor yet because I'm working. Uh, you know, it's a lot, lot of stories. But even today, I was still going to pursue the plan next week to f still phone him and remind him. And then today, from nowhere, I was just sitting there. My father just, you know, he was like, I saw him, he was not like here now. And then he just gave me the uh, the cup. And then the, the Holy Communion, it, okay, I drank it, but it went straight here, straight, straight here, straight here. That's why I was hitting myself like this, because it went straight to the pain, it's like it was gripping the pain or something. I hit it, I hit it, and then it stopped. Until now, as you see me. You don't, you don't feel the pain, you're okay. Nothing. And when you were eating, were you struggling with this yeah. too? You won't believe. I was using this side. side. And then I, I, I love millies. Yo, I will struggle, I'll cut it with a knife and chew this using one side. And now I'm healed. So and now you're going to enjoy a meal. I'm going to enjoy a meal. And I must say something. Even Lina Manik's told I was not able to chew meat and then my father said I was stealing you know what I, I was playing he saved me from stealing because what I was planning me and my son it was stealing yeah so mama we know that a lot of people when they reach our old age they get diseases they experience these problems but we know that that is not for us christians it is for the world yeah. so now that god has manifested his power inside of you like how do you feel about the whole situation because now it's like you've been renewed you're a young girl again we don't see an old woman here we see a young see girl that again because you know what amazes me i i've never complained to anyone about except my family even my father didn't know that i'm suffering from this you know he just gave me the Holy Communion. You know, I, I don't know. What I can just say, the healing is here. The presence of the Lord is here. Everything is here. I bless God. To God be the glory. There you very blessed viewers. It is to God be the glory from all of us in Rawani Center. We really are grateful, Mama, that God has restored you. You are going to enjoy yourself. You are going to enjoy your meals. You will not go out without even losing your tooth. You are going to eat your meat today. We bless the Lord for such a beautiful testimony. Blessed viewers, there is no disease for all people. That is not for the kingdom of God. God restores and we live in a forever refreshing season. To God be the glory.